Duke and Wake Forest. It's been 72 years since the Blue Devils enjoyed a nine-win season. The last time they ended up hosting the Rose Bowl because of Pearl Harbor. The Blue Devils open it up early. Anthony Boone to Isaac Blakeney. Blakeney loses the ball. Thomas Brown scoops it up, fights off the tackle, and scores. But was Blakeney's knee down? Replays inconclusive. Wake Forest takes the touchdown up 7-0. And Tanner Price has the Demon Deacons driving. Spencer Bishop takes it into the end zone. 14-0 Wake Forest. Uh-oh. This is looking like old Duke. Where's the new Duke? Anthony Boone gets it going. Boone to Jamison Crowder. 10-yard touchdown. Duke down 14-7 and just over a minute to go before the half. Boone up to Max McCaffrey. Hauls it in. Touchdown. So the Blue Devils and Demon Deacons go into the half, tied at 14. The Demon Deacons come out sharp. A nine-play, 75-yard drive. Price keeps it himself for the last 12. 21-14, Wake Forest gets the lead back. But Duke responds quickly. Boone, up top, Crowder, 58-yard touchdown. Crowder's second touchdown of the game. He goes over 1,000 yards in receiving for the second straight season. We're tied. And Boone keeps it on the ground. 20 yards inside the five. He had 256 through the air. Another 57 by land. First and goal. Enter the phantom. Brandon Kinnett fights his way in. Duke with its first lead up 28-21. Under three minutes to go. Wake Forest driving, looking for that game-tying score. Tanner Price intercepted by Ross Cockrell. He sets a new school record with 52 career passes defended. That seals it for the Blue Devils. Duke wins 28-21. The Blue Devils are 9-2. Let that sink in. The Blue Devils are 9-2 and, and one win away from playing in the ACC title game. Jameson Crowder, 10 catches for 121 yards. I'm Jeff Fischel with the ACC Digital Network. Coming November 25th, the ACC Digital Network presents The Greatest, a series revealing the top 10 ACC quarterbacks of all time as decided on by a panel of ACC football experts. Which great signal callers are among the top 10 from an ACC school? Find out on November 25th, only on the ACC Digital Network.